I've mentioned before that I don't believe that either theists nor atheists have constructed an adequate model for the term God, uh, definition, description, um, whatever. Uh, and I believe that this is important. Uh, in fact, I, I believe that it's central. And not only that, I believe that it is central and utterly important for both sides to have a definition that they both agree on. Because if, in the absence of such an agreed-upon definition, all that either side may be doing is strawmanning the other. Um, you hear all these things about uh, atheists or uh, people who do this, that, or the other from the religious people, or some religious people, I guess. Um, and you hear all kinds of things like, um, I don't know, sky spook or whatever from atheists. Um, they may not be talking about the same thing. Now, in as much as there's some sort of a competition between the two, I understand that this sort of thing is, in, is inevitable. But that's that, the, any competition doesn't have any interest to, to me whatsoever. I'm, I'm, I don't care. Um, it's nothing to do with me. What I'm interested in is the actual reality of the situation. Um, what are we talking about when we say God? And if I say that God is uh, just an immortal being that created the universe, is that all there is to say about God? If I put that to a theist, is that theist going to say, yes, you've, you've pegged it, that's exactly what I mean by God? I rather suspect that a theist would say a little bit more than that. Whereas uh, a theist might say to an atheist, yeah, you believe in nothing, you believe in uh, just um, uh, a, a lifeless, formless, random universe that doesn't really do anything or go anywhere, which is probably a straw man of the atheist position. Um, so, um, I do think that this cries out for a lot more debate, um, and if nothing else, we'll at least uh, get somewhere in terms of understanding the other in as much as we come to understand how little we do understand about the other one. I think that the atheist-theist thing, uh, I won't really say that it's a false dichotomy in as much as um, it's a much wider debate than we think it is. Is this atheists versus theists, or is this the existence of God versus the non-existence of God? Uh, because that's not the two are not the same thing, and not only that, before we can even start discussing the second one, uh, we, en we must at least have some working model, definition, description, illustration of what we mean by God. Um, so far, in uh, years, many years, decades of looking into this, I have not found a single satisfactory definition of God from either theists or atheists. Thank you.